you hi all fat andy here eh? right did a um beef brisket yesterday roast dinner had some meat left over so i thought um well let's you know use it and um make a pie so uh i grabbed some puff pastry um couldn't get any short crust they'd run out um so i grabbed some of that and um basically what i've done if you have a look is um, I've rolled it out, put it into a pie dish, got the base there, or oh, sorry, got the top there, rolled that out as well. And um, what I'm gonna do is um, put the meat in from yesterday, what was left over, which I've cut up into chunks. Just gonna basically put the meat, bend it down a little bit, put that meat, into here see that there get the meat put it into the pie base spread the meat out what's left like so and all we're gonna do is get some gravy This is the gravy what was uh, left over from yesterday. I've added a little bit of onion to it. Lovely and thick. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. And all we're going to do is to pour that all over this meat. Like so. Into the edges. Spread it all out. Like so. Make sure she's all in the corners. Bloody lovely this is. And then all we're going to get, just twist it down a bit more, is get the dish, get the top for the pastry, and lay it over the top like so pat it all in round the edges trim off the edges like so All the way around like that put that in with your fingers around the edges seal it up and then all we're going to get is an egg with a little bit of milk and we're just going to brush it on just get yourself a brush Like so. I'm just going to brush that all over the top of this, and then when this is cooked, be a lovely, lovely golden brown on top. This really, at the end of the day, just just saves. I mean, you can have the meat with potatoes on its own, but I think myself, let's make a lovely pie with it. And you've got all the used gravy, leftover gravy from yesterday with all the meat juices and everything. Like so. And that will come out absolutely gorgeous. I've done this several times before in the past and it is really, really tasty. The meat goes so tender and everything. And then all we need to do, get a knife, just make a little cross or something in the middle to escape. And that's it. There you have a lovely beef brisket pie. That'll go in the oven 
Um, probably 40 minutes, about a 180 until brown. I will let you know when I take it out. And um, yeah, lovely. One pie cooked and out of the oven. And here's the finished article. A lovely brisket pie with red cabbage, mashed potatoes and gravy. Look at that, that came out an absolute treat. If you like this sort of video, please give it a like and a thumbs up, comments in below, and um, I'll catch you in the next one.